Thanks for tuning in again. And again, this is Shikama Live from Blog TV. Your host, Kevin Cardinale. This is a segment I call Tech Talk. Today, I'd like to talk about a new program. Well, not a new program, but a program that I just happened upon about a month ago. Uh, and it is called Windows Patrol. So let's go to it. And always, this is my, web, my lovely website that I just started called www.igainmusclelosefat.com. Igainmusclelosefat.com. Okay, so this is the actual pop pop up for the application. But let's go over to the actual website where you can download it. And it's called www.winpatrol.com. Winpatrol.com. And uh, they have Scotty the dog. I guess it's a black Scottish terrier uh, as their little uh, mascot and icon. And you can, of course, purchase it or you can download it for free, like I do. <laughs> Since I'm broke. And you will always hear me say that. Here's Scotty's little house here. Woohoo! Anyway, once you have downloaded it, it will sit in your uh, system tray right over here. And what it does is it will stop applications uh, from trying to either be surreptitiously installed into your start menu unbeknownst to you uh, or, or spam uh, coming into your computer or viruses or, or spyware, malware. It catches all of that stuff. And he will bark and say, this program is about to be installed. I don't have an example of it. Uh, this is not the window that will come up. But it will say, this program is trying to be installed onto your computer. Do you want to allow this? And a lot of times, it's something that you have not agreed to. Uh, let's say you were installing something, uh, and you were... You were, you were installing multiple parts of it. Say it was an application that you had to install, let's say three parts of it. Of course, the, app, the installation process goes, you click run, then it goes through the install shield and it says, do you agree to these terms? And you say, yes. Do you agree to put in this folder? Yes. Next. Uh, do you, this the modules that are gonna be installed? Yes. Next. And, say about the second one you're just clicking next 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 well on one of those windows that you say next to and agree to it says do you want to uh, include the yahoo toolbar do you want to include the google toolbar do you want to include the uh uh your mom uh, is a whore toolbar and you're just clicking next scotty will then pop up and say do you really want to put uh your mom is a whore toolbar on your computer and you go, of course I did not want to put that on my computer. And you can click no, and it will not install it. And the installation will continue as if you had not okayed that in the first place. So, you can circumvent a lot of secret little things. They might not, sometimes they are very secret because I don't agree to stuff. And they come up as if, uh, uh, I had agreed to install it. Sometimes it's spyware that is trying to install stuff. So out of the blue, I'll get Scotty saying, were you aware that you wanted to install the IEDB helper? And I go, no, I didn't, I haven't clicked anything. I was watching a video on YouTube. <laughs> anyway, that's windpatrol.com. Go ahead and download Scotty for free. If you like it, pay for it. That is my tech, tech, tech tip for the day. I said that three times fast. All right, and once again, this is Kevin Cardinale, and please visit my website www.igainmusclelosefat.com. Thank you for tuning in.
Kempt Cardinale out.